It's really Jack and Dominic. So now it looks like the lovers quarrel between Birdman and Lil Wayne. It's not looking too good, man. It looked like they're already heading to court over fucking eight million dollars. But not only that, it appears that Lil Wayne and Birdman will be going through some type of custody battle for the fucking artist. Because in any fucking divorce, you got to think about what about them kids, man? Now, pretty much. Lil Wayne says, yo, I want off cash money, uh, give me the 8 million, whatever the case is, and not only that, I also want to take all my artists signed to Young Money Entertainment. Now, Birdman is saying, he's doing a Birdman hand rub, he's like, oh, what, Playboy? No, 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 you ain't going nowhere. Now, it seems that it might get from bad to worse, as I said before, just because, hey, all these artists who are signed to Young Money are really, in a sense, signed to cash money. Now, Young Money is a imprint of off cash money which for branding purposes and it does operate somewhat like a record label however the decisions and also finances do profit cash money and it also gets distributed by the same company which is our republic records now young money entertainment pretty much they have had the successful albums of recent i mean we're talking about pink friday pink friday roman reloaded the carter four we're talking about i'm not a human being the carter three we're talking about thank me later take care nothing was the same all those releases came out on young money now this is a problem because all these artists you see signed to Young Money, in a sense, they're really all signed to Cash Money. Now, here's the thing, because let me let you know how it breaks down. So, we have Universal Music Group that all these people are under. And I'm talking about there are tons of different um, record labels under Universal Music Group. It's one of the top three, or one of, it's one of the three big groups that controls the entire major label record. So, UMG. UMG is pretty much um, the big behemoth that, that's a uh, music group. There's only three of them. It's Sony, Warner, and... Um, Universal Music Group. Universal Music Group is actually the biggest. I mean, all these companies fall under it. We're talking about um, Def Jam. We're talking about Republic Records. We're talking about Capital Music and even Interscope. They're all within UMG. So imagine the amount of artists it controls. Now, Cash Money is actually a subsidiary of UMG. And then we have uh, Young Money Entertainment, which is kind of a subsidiary of Cash Money. Which means, anytime fucking Drake spits a rhyme, anytime Nicki pops a pussy or some shit like that, the people who profit off that is not only Lil Wayne, but Birdman as well, and also UMG. All those people gotta split the revenue off that case, right? That If you're wondering, that's the same reason why Lil Wayne didn't bring OVO under cash money. Because if you brought OVO under cash money... When you got paid, Lil Wayne would have to get paid. When Lil Wayne got paid, Birdman would have to get paid. When Birdman get paid, UMG has to get paid. Now, there's too many goddamn hands in the pot for you to start a new record label. Now, he brought OVO Sound to Warner and its Warner Music Group, which is completely separate from Universal Music Group. That's the reason why. You have Universal Music Group with Cash Money, Young Money and them. Drake did a smart thing. Of course, he's Jewish. He brought his fucking record label over to Warner where he's a direct subsidiary, which means he could have some type of um, setup where he's getting more of the profit split. Now, this thing with um, Lil Wayne planning to take all the Young Money artists, I don't think it'll happen. I mean, first of all, I don't think there's nobody trying to trying to sign fucking gutter gutter. Right? I don't think nobody's really trying to just see what's up with Bow Wow. However... His, his roster on Young Money is kind of impressive. Just the fact that you got Drake and Nicki on there, that's impressive enough. And even Tyga, even though Tyga's been saying he's independent, which we know he isn't because there's a contract, Negro. You could act like you're independent, but there's a contract that binds you to being signed. Now, I don't see how this even happens. I don't see how Birdman just gives up all the control without a long legal battle or him getting compensated for each and every one of those contracts for him to say, okay, I'm giving you the rights and the sole profits for whatever efforts they put out. Come on now. I don't see it happening. So I think this is good in theory, man. I think it's going to come down to a long legal battle. It's probably going to be one of those things just like a real divorce where you think about it, you look at the legal process, you look at the money you're going to spend going through it, and you're like, you know what, fuck it, man. It's cheaper to keep it. We're just going to act like um, we're still married. I'm going to still fuck with my side chicks. I'm going to live with them. But we're going to still be in this relationship because until you just work out those contractual obligations by putting those albums out, 
trying to get separated at least and holding off the music until that happens is going to take way too long. I don't believe that's going to be the case. So I, I think throw this in the bushes. I mean, nobody's really interested in, in, in fucking a little twister and, and Christina Milian on Young Money Entertainment. As long as, Bur as long as Drake's and Nicki Minaj's projects could come out fine, let it go, bro. You just got to let it go because I don't see it happening. I don't see you getting off cash money with your imprint, and then they're like, okay, go ahead. Unless you're willing to pay Burnman a shit ton of money. So, what do you guys think, man? Get in the comment box. Make sure you guys like. Definitely subscribe. It's your boy DJ Academics. Follow me on Instagram at I'm Academics. I'm out.